what is going on supreme family what is going on if you can see me and you can hear me go ahead and drop the number one for me all right if you guys can see me and you can hear me go ahead and drop the number one for me we have a lot of things being covered haven't really seen you guys in like a little bit over a week so chat i want to be able to hear you guys if you guys can see me drop the number one if you guys can drop your state or country you're currently watching from as well that would also be appreciated I ended up just now getting back into the United States. I spent the last couple days in the Dominican Republic. Now I'm back out here ready to keep going crazy. And today is Black Friday. So if you guys are not going crazy right now, this is the time to be able to do so. You still have Cyber Monday coming up this Monday and you have Christmas. So really, really important time that we really go ahead and take advantage of this. And I'm excited to go ahead and get into it. I'm going to go ahead and open everything up on my side and we're going to go ahead and get going here. All right. I'm seeing Netherlands in the house, Pakistan, Afghanistan, India, Canada, New Zealand, Bangladesh, Pakistan. All right, I love to go ahead and see it. I love to go ahead and see it. All right, if this is your first time ever in a live Q&A with me, go ahead and say first time uh, as well. All right, if you've been here before, you already know what to do. Go ahead and drop the number two. All right, we got Ohio, Germany, DC. What is going on? If you guys are currently running ads or taking advantage of Black Friday, go ahead and let me know in the chat section as well, all right? Now, we're gonna go ahead and wait on a couple more people to join in, but for everyone who is in here, I do put on these lives every single week. I do typically do them on Wednesdays at 12 p.m. Central Time. Today, because of you know the holidays and everything, we're gonna be you know jumping into it right now, 12 p.m. Friday, November 24th, <clears throat> to give you guys more support on all the things that you guys need support in, all right? Now today, I'm going to be covering the product research tools that you need to know about in order to have the most success when it comes to finding winning products. So if you guys want to tell me right now what uh, product research tools you guys are using, you can let me know in the chat section. If you have not used any product research tools yet, go ahead and drop the number one, all right? But today, I'm going to be talking about paid product research tools, free product research tools, and product research tools that are right in front of your face every single day. Now, while we're going to go ahead and wait on some more people to join in, like I said, let me know where you're currently watching from and where you're currently at with your dropshipping journey, okay? I'm seeing Martin saying Philadelphia, first timer. KM saying first time, full beginner. All right, I'd love to see it. All right, tech support, I got you today. Don't worry. All right, we got Muhammad in here saying first time. Okay, all right, got some familiar, familiar faces in here as well. Okay, Pakistan, Zimbabwe. All right, I love to see it. I love to see it. Muhammad, reach out to me on Instagram. All right, I got you. Okay, make sure to please do not spam the chat section. Okay, please do not spam the chat section. But today, for the people who are in here for the first time, okay, I will be sharing my screen. So I will be sharing my screen and I'll be walking you guys through different methods that you guys can be taking advantage of right now, okay? So if you guys do want to take advantage of this sheet, also make sure to go ahead and smash that like button down below because once this video reaches 250 likes, I'm going to go ahead and give you guys this full cheat sheet down below, all right? All right. Now, like I said, I'll be covering product research, finding you guys a couple winning products that you guys will be selling all throughout December. The value does not stop there. I'll also be giving out a free one-on-one -on -one consulting call to a lucky winner today. So make sure you're, spent, you're paying attention and staying to the very end to make sure that you can get the opportunity of winning this free consulting call, all right? And by the way, if you guys have not checked out my How to Start Dropshipping YouTube video that I just dropped last week, as well as some of these winning products, okay? This video right here and this video right here, I'm giving out some huge giveaways. So if you've already watched both of these, go ahead and drop the number one. If you haven't, go ahead and drop the number two. Big, big giveaways happening in both of these. So I hope that you guys are excited for it, okay? Now, we're ready to go ahead and get into it, okay? I'm seeing, let me go ahead and pull everything up on my side. Let me go ahead and pull everything up on my side, all right? I got a tan, man. I definitely did. All right, we got Columbia in the house. Uh, Edward, what up, my boy? Happy to have you. Morocco, Connecticut. Okay, love to have you guys in here, all right? Now, if any of you guys are in here ready to go ahead and get going, let's go ahead and get into it, okay? We're going to go ahead and get into the first thing. So, 
Let me know right now, okay? Drop any questions that you guys have about product research tools that you may be using. Let me know the product research tools that you're using in the chat section so I can also be answering your questions throughout this live, okay? All right, I see you guys are ready, okay? Now let's go ahead and get into the first one. So the first thing I wanna go ahead and do is talk about the importance of understanding trends, okay? Understanding trends in order to find products that you should be selling so that you're not wasting time while doing your product research. Now, if you do not know what you, what I mean by understanding trends, okay, I want you guys to go ahead and check out this video after this, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and post it down below. But in short, okay, every single month or season you're the, uh, you're, any season you're in, there's going to be consumer trends that happen when consumers are looking for specific products at a specific time, okay? And this is where the first product research tool that you'll need to help find winning products is gonna come into play which is going to be Google Trends, okay? This is where the first one is gonna come into play, which is Google Trends. Now, with Google Trends, I wanna to talk to you guys about how important this is and understanding what to actually search for. And, you know, this is actually the first step in order to find any winning products, okay? So Kevin's saying, what are some products for December? Kevin, I got you. If you are going to stay to the very end today, go ahead and drop the number one, because I'm actually gonna give you guys five to 10 winning products that you could take advantage of today. All right, so what I want you guys to understand is like I said, this is the first step, okay? When we come over here, if you guys have used Google Trends, one for yes or two for no. All right, I wanna talk about a trend that you guys should not be selling in and why. So why do you guys believe that you should not be selling in this trend right now? Can you guys give me some more information in the chat section, okay? Why is fall items not something that you should be taking advantage of right now? Okay, and for the people who are asking about my one-on-one -on -one mentorship, I have opened up 10 new spots for the month of December for my one-on-one -on -one mentorship, and I actually have a Black Friday sale going on right now, okay? So if you guys wanna take advantage of this, I do have a Black Friday sale going on right now. You can apply right here, okay? You guys are gonna get $500 off any of my mentorship packages, okay? All of it's one-on-one, -on -one. or you can reach out to me on my Instagram at AC underscore Hampton, okay? So what you guys are noticing is this is declining. So when this is declining like this, what is this telling you? That this is not a favorable trend, right? If we know that consumers are not gonna be searching for something and we know that the demand behind this trend is going down, we don't wanna try to sell products that go with this, okay? Coach Adam, does that make sense? David, does it make sense? Chili, okay, Just Smile, Fallen Angel. Now this is gonna be very interactive today. Okay, if you guys wanna to go to a different live Q&A or go watch a random YouTube video where you're not gonna get your questions answered, they're not gonna to speak to you guys directly, then go somewhere else, okay? Because today, I'm gonna to be speaking to you guys directly and making sure you understand the things that I'm talking about, okay? So this is a trend that you should not be selling because again, you can understand that this is going down. While we can see another trend like this is starting to go up, right? Just like you were just saying online money, while saying the winter trend is going up. So when we're noticing that the winter trip uh, is going up and you see that it spikes up right around 130 to 140,000 search volumes and we're sitting right around 60,000, this is showing that we are not even in the midst of it spiking up. So I wanna talk to you about why this is important because also you have to understand that when it gets up to here, you have to understand a very, very key important thing and I want you guys to understand this, write this down okay barriers to entry all right if you have your notebooks out you have wrote this down go ahead and drop the number one okay but barriers to entry is this first step of product research okay where in economics okay we're noticing what factors can prevent or impede other new people like you guys and myself to hop into a market or an industry sector and understanding the competition that goes behind it okay so the higher the competition the higher the startup costs and the more obstacles that you will need to go through so when I'm looking for trends, okay, I'm looking for things that I know that have low barriers to entry, okay? Let's go ahead and check out another one, all right? I'll show you a, a trend that you guys should be focusing on that's coming up as well here soon, which is Valentine's Day. Now, you guys notice that Valentine's Day, on the second week of December, every year, this starts, to start, uh, this starts trending, right? So when do you guys believe that you should be getting into the Valentine's Day, okay? You guys let me know, chat, okay? Coach, Life with Vanny, okay? Huzafa, David, Usama, the people who are in here who are really paying attention, okay? I'm gonna be talking to you guys directly. So 
when do you believe that the lowest barriers to entry for this market is and when do you believe that you should hop in would it be the second week of december would it be the second week of january would you want to get in the first week of february when do you believe that you should be getting in okay because i want to talk to you guys about how consumers are going to do the same thing every single year when it comes to shopping habits okay so if we just look at these trends and we know that consumer trends are going to match what consumers are doing then we know that we want to hop in right around here where the barriers to entry are the lowest okay now only thing you need is you just need resources like google trends to help you know when to start selling these items and when to start selling these stop selling these items so i'm gonna ask you guys one last question okay i'm seeing you guys saying second week of december online money saying i want to sell the rose bear for valentine's day okay great now i'm gonna ask you guys one last question before we continue when do you stop selling winter okay when should you stop selling the winter trend would it be the second week of february would it be the first week of january when do you believe that you should stop selling dur during the winter trend okay because i'm gonna tell you guys right now okay some of you guys are saying the second week of december when am i going to stop selling towards the second week of uh or or towards winter is going to be right here with right around the first week of january all right because I noticed that the search volume is right under 100,000, and I know that people are not actively searching for this anymore. Does that make sense? Okay, I'm not going to stop, stop selling at the peak. No, no, no. I'm going to start reducing some of my ads, okay, lowering some of my budgets on my ads. But that does not mean I'm going to stop selling towards it completely. Again, I'm going to start selling towards it right in January, okay? So I want to make that clear that you do not stop selling right when it hits a peak. You stop selling the second, okay, you know, you're getting really closer towards a downward trend. So now that you understand this, I want to go a little bit further to prove this point, okay? So when you guys are looking at, you know, winter stuff, okay, you guys are noticing again that this is starting to go down right now, right? So I'm looking at this winter trend. I'm noticing that this is starting to go down right around January. So what is the next season that I should be picking up? Well, the next season I should be picking up is springtime, okay? Where you see spring is picking up right on the first week of January. So does this make sense? One for yes or two for no, okay? This is when consumers are gonna start transitioning their mindset to thinking into the next months ahead, okay? So when you know how to take advantage of two separate seasons, you just have to understand how to do it when the data is going to back it up, okay? And now once you understand the seasons and trends, okay? Because again, this is the first step. And by the way, if you guys want this document, smash the like button down below and get this video to 250 likes, okay? Once I understand this and I understand the trends, okay? Now I need to find the products that fall within those trends. And I'm gonna show you guys some different tools so that you guys can be the first ones to be able to do so, all right? And one of my favorite tools to be able to do this is called AutoDS, okay? Now I'm gonna start with AutoDS because it is a paid product research tool, which means I'm gonna help you be more efficient uh, when it comes to product research. Now again, today I'm gonna be showing you guys free and paid product research tools. So make sure to be on the lookout for both. Lior saying, so much value in the first 10 minutes. Just wanna thank you so much. Of course, I got you in here. All right, that's why I'm telling you guys, I have a lot of big things coming out. Not am I just gonna give you guys winning products today. Not am I just going to give you a giveaway. Not am I just gonna show you guys the best product research tools, but I'll also be answering your questions so you guys are feeling more confident after this, okay? And for the people who are saying, is this stream gonna be available after this to watch? It will once it reaches 250 likes, okay? Well, the first thing I want you guys to understand, okay, is I like using AutoDS, okay? Why do I like using AutoDS? Is because not can I just find winning products on here, but I can also have suppliers who can fulfill them on this platform as well. So if you guys do want to go ahead and get started with AutoDS, okay, I'm going to go ahead and post the link down below. It's going to give you guys your first 30 days for free. All right. So once you're in AutoDS, it's going to look a little bit like this, okay, where you're going to notice it has winning products, a marketplace, TikTok spy, and more, okay? So once I'm on here, okay, I want to start off with this marketplace section as this shows you guys a, a bunch of different products that you guys can search through that also go with the seasons and trends that are happening. So this is what this marketplace section looks like where you guys can filter down by different niches, different categories, 
I can even come over here and type something like winter. And, you know, since we know that this is a trend that's happening right now, we can see other winter, winter products that go with this. Okay. So, you know, with spring, I might type something like this, you know, any type of major holiday, this is where I'm going to be finding products at. Okay. Now, mind you, I can find winning products here all day long. Okay. But the next place I like going ahead and looking at, okay. And look, this is, you guys look at this real quick. This is on the marketplace section. Would this product right here make sense to be sold during the winter time? One for yes or two for no. Okay. Because I want to show you guys something real quick. Do you have to pay for AutoDS? It is a paid product research tool, but that link that I just sent you guys is going to give you guys 30 days for free. Okay. Watch this real quick. Okay. Now you guys see this winter niche. Okay. You guys see the same winter. This is how you guys can find if products go with the season or trend. If I type in the season, like winter or the trend that's happening, and I type in the product itself, okay, let's just do it side by side. Okay. Are you guys noticing anything specifically? Okay. I want you guys to see when this trend of heated gloves starts picking up. Okay, let me move myself. You see how where this trend of heated gloves is starting to pick up, which is, again, September all the way up to right around January 1st. And you're seeing the winter niche is starting right around September up into January 1st. So I'm going to ask you guys a question, one for yes or two for no. Does this product go with the season or trend? Okay, because this is the things that you need to be doing and you need to be comparing and contrasting with. All right, so after I find a product, just like I did on AutoDS, I'm going to take this same product. I'm going to take it back to Google Trends and I'm going to see, okay, is this going with the season or trend that I'm currently looking at? All right, the next thing I'm going to go ahead and look for, all right, is, okay, are there other people who are selling it, right? I'm noticing all this right here. When I find a product on AutoDS, and I'm gonna come back here in a second, I like to come over here and I like to type in the I like to type in the product into Google, which is heated gloves, okay? And I like writing plus myshopify.com. Okay, does this make sense? Okay. This is this section right here. Okay. So once I find a product and I make sure that it goes with the season or trend. I will now type into the product uh, into Google plus myshopify.com to see are there other Shopify stores who are running this product today. Okay. Once I do this, which you see all these people are running products towards it today, right? I can open up a bunch of these, right? I can open up a bunch of these. It doesn't matter who they are. doesn't matter how many reviews they have. Only thing is I'm not going to open up is things like Amazon. Okay. I'm going to be trying to open up the mom and pop places, right? Now, once I open this stuff up, okay, and I see that, okay, we have winning, we have a winning product on our hand, okay? We're going to validate it a little bit more, okay? The next thing I'm going to go ahead and do is validate that this is a product that makes sense, okay? So look, I want you guys to read this stuff off real quick. Does it have a problem solving factor or a wow factor? These are the things that I'm looking for. Okay. Does it have features and benefits that make me want to go ahead and sell this product? You guys tell me, okay. Is it knocking this out the park of the things that I'm asking for? Does it have good features and benefits? Does it solve a problem? Does it have a wow factor? Okay. These are how we're validating these products. Okay. The next thing. Okay. Is this in demand with the season and trend? Okay. Chili and Nagma and Babai and Ryan and Usman and Muhammad. Okay. Is this going in demand with the season and trend? Okay. Does this have active competitors who are running ads towards it today? Okay. You guys are noticing that there are active ad, uh, people who are running ads towards it today. Okay. I can take it one step further. Have you guys ever heard of Facebook ad library? Yes or no? You guys let me know in the chat section. Because now am I just finding winning products right here on Google, okay, of people who are advertising it. 
but I can also come over here to Facebook ad library, type in the same product, okay, heated gloves, and see are there other people who are actively advertising it today as well, which you see that I'm finding multiple things. Action. I'm not finding just heated gloves, but I'm also finding a heated jacket as well as a heated scarf. Okay, so I'm gonna ask you guys a question. Look at how I just found three to four winning products all within a couple minutes. Heated sock, oh, heated socks, heated vest, heated gloves, heated, heated uh, scarf, right? Did you notice how I'm starting to find a lot of winning products very, very quickly? Now, when I come over here, one thing I'm noticing is that these people have 14 ads being used today. So when I'm noticing that multiple people are running ads towards it today, that's also noticing that they are spending money on ads. And if someone's going to be spending this amount of money on ads, they're going to be making money in turn. So when I come over here and I look at their website, okay, and I go to it, I can see all these other winning products that they're taking advantage of. Here's all these heated vests, right? Here's the heated gloves, here's the heated socks. Would it make sense to be taking advantage of this? One for yes or two for no. But again, this is how I find winning products on Facebook ad library as well. So far this season. Look, this would go great for construction workers, people who snowboard, people who do outside activities, people who work in the outside, people who travel a lot, okay? You guys have to start thinking of these things as well. Next thing we're looking for when we find these is, okay, is there traffic going to the competitor's website today? So how do we find out if they are getting traffic today? I told you guys, smash that like button down below if you guys are wanting to take advantage of this, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and go live real quick on, on Instagram, okay? Let me go ahead and get you guys going real quick. Let me go ahead and get you guys going real quick, all right? So now that I understand, okay, that these heated gloves are doing really, really well, I also understand that I have to find out who is getting traffic on their store today. So the best way that I like being able to find out if they are getting traffic is by taking advantage of uh, similar web okay and for all the people who are now just joining my youtube if you guys or my instagram if you guys do want to join my youtube go ahead and join it right here on my uh right uh right on my youtube channel okay but how do i figure that out okay is with this tool right here called similar web all right so similar web is the next step that i'm looking for when it comes to validating a winning product okay so what you're going to notice is that similar web gives you traffic analysis to understand who is getting traffic and who is not all right, and mind you, we only we don't want to reinvent the wheel, so we want to find out who is getting traffic and double down on those people. So now that I've opened up a bunch of these competitors, okay? Now that I've opened up a bunch of these competitors, I'm going to go ahead and do this real quick. Join my YouTube for the live, okay? I'm going to go ahead and post this down below. And by the way, I'm giving out some Black Friday crazy things. I'm going to give out two giveaways today because it's Black Friday. So if you guys want to take advantage of it, make sure that you guys are here, okay? But now that once I open up similar web, what you're going to notice is I have to go ahead and click on the Chrome extension and I can see are they getting more traffic today. So what you're going to notice on the screen is, okay, what are you seeing, Edward, Chili, David, okay, Kerne? What are you noticing in their traffic within September all the way October? Are you noticing that this traffic on this competitor's website is matching this trend or season one for yes or two for no, okay? Are you noticing that this traffic that is picking up on their store is also being able to be picked up right with the traffic that's being shown? So if I'm noticing, okay, that this person alone is having 67,000 visitors on their website last month alone, and I also notice on Facebook ad library that multiple people are running this product today, then the next thing I can go ahead and do is just figure out how much money this store is making today. So would you guys like me to go ahead and give you a simple equation to know A, how much money this store is making last month alone, 
knowing if the product is actually validated to a T and knowing where to advertise it. You guys can say yes or no in the chat section for me, okay? So what I'm gonna go ahead and do, okay, for the people who are saying yes, watch this. I want all of you guys to take your calculators out, okay, and tell me when you guys are ready, okay? Because I'm taking this to the fullest extreme. I'm not just showing you paid product research tools. I'm showing you free product research tools. And more importantly, I'm giving you guys winning products and showing you how I identify the validation behind them. Okay, I see Kerne in here. I've seen Mohammed saying yes. All right, bet. So watch this real quick, okay? Take your guys' calculators out real quick. So we see last month alone, they had 67,000 visitors last month, okay? So take 67,000 and put it in your, cal in your calculator, all right? The next thing I want you guys to do is go ahead and multiply this by the industry Shopify conversion rate, which is 2.5%, okay? So if you take this 67,000 and multiply it by 2.5%, Okay, you're going to notice that it comes out to 1,675, okay? So this 1,675 is a quantitative estimate of about how much money they made or how many orders they had last month alone, okay? So now that we see that they had 1, 1,675 and we notice that their selling price of their product is $120, we're going to take this $120. And that's going to bring out right around $201,000 that they made last month just selling this product that goes with the season and trend that is currently happening right now. Okay, so I'm asking you guys a question real quick. If you were able to find a product that goes with the season and trend, that solves a problem, that has a wow factor, that it has great features and benefits, that is also making sure that it can be sold between $30 and $125. And you notice that other people are advertising it today and you were able to take it and then the next month make over two hundred thousand dollars would you be would you implicate would you uh would you apply the same exact methods i'm showing you today yes or no because it's not even just that let me go even further to validate products so you guys know what i'm talking about if i notice that uh, they made two hundred thousand dollars last month alone and I'm noticing right here on their website that set over 50% of their traffic is in the United States. Where do you believe that you should be advertising as well? Because this is going to give you guys a very good indicator of not just who to base yourself off of, but also where to advertise the product. Okay? So look, we can do this down the line all day long. Okay? Is this person getting traffic? Again, you're noticing that it's upward trending as well. So this is another great uh, competitor who has over 192,000 visitors last month alone. Let's go to this other competitor, okay? Look, you see it's also spiking up. So these are the things that I'm looking for when I'm trying to validate a winning product, all right? Now, now that I have that, the next thing that I need to go ahead and do, okay, is I need to make sure that I can get the product for the right type of cost of goods sold. So as you guys see, this product is $120, right? So if this product is $120, let me show you how I validate a winning product past just knowing if there's demand behind it, okay? And that is by making sure that I can get at least a 2.5x margin on the selling price compared to the cost of goods sold, all right? People in my Instagram live Q&A, man, I hope you guys are showing up. You guys see I'm sharing my screen. I'm showing you guys everything in here. I hope you guys can pull up, man. I hope you guys can pull up. I'm giving out huge giveaways today because of Black Friday. And also, everybody who's watching, like I told you guys, you're all getting $500 off any of my one-on-one -on -one mentorship packages for the 10 spots that we have left. So I hope you guys take advantage of it, all right? But now, now that we understand this, okay, you want to go to your neck, your supplier. It could be AutoDS, AliExpress, wherever you want. And I want to show you guys how I know that this product is going to be a banger and also how I know I've sold it for over six figures before. All right. When I come over here and I look up the heated gloves, okay, you're noticing that majority of people have been selling this product and a lot of drop shippers have sold this product as well. So this product right here is $11.90. Okay. Well, you know, right around $11.90, you know, on here. When I come over here, and I want to make sure that I'm profitable with the product, this is how I'm going to go ahead and do so, all right? 
What I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm now gonna take the selling price of the product, which is $119.95, and I'm gonna divide it by 2.5, which is going to tell me the most that I can spend on this product is $47.98. So now that you guys can see that this is profitable, you guys could sell this product today as well. Did this steps of validation make sense to you? One for yes or two for no, because I am not done. I am not done. That was just a little bit, okay? That is just a little bit. Let's go ahead and get into the next section. So I told you guys, the first section that you guys can use on AutoDS is the marketplace section. The next place is the winning product section, okay? Where AutoDS actually adds new winning products every single day to this section so that you'll be able to see new stuff every single time that you log in. And by the way, where people are saying that there's a lot of competition, that is why I tell you that barriers to entry are very important because you need to validate that there is less than three to five competitors who are actively scaling multiple ads towards it today. So how do you know if somebody's actively running ads and scaling it? Well, you'll notice it when you're seeing things like this, where it says like 14 ads in use, or you go and click on their actual, uh, on their actual Facebook page, okay? And you can view all of their ads as well. Okay, Tito saying, um, you know, no product is ever saturated. Tito, only advertisements are saturated. Okay, so when I, I want to show you guys how you guys can also spy on com literally all of your competitors. When I come over here and click on about, and I come over here and click on page transparency, and I click on see all, and I come down over here and click on go to ad library, I can see all of their ads that they are running today. So look, now I can see all of their ads and know what type of marketing angles they are focused on and if they are even somebody that I should be basing myself off of or not, okay? So look, this is where you guys can figure all of this out right now, okay? Now the next step, like I told you, on Facebook Marketplace, you guys are gonna be able, or on, on AutoDS, is this winning product section where you're gonna notice that there's winning products added to it every day single day let's just take you know let's just take this one for example okay let's even take this one for example because i honestly i like this product too okay when we see the same heated vest look at this heated vest right here when i scroll down on auto ds i can actually see the competitor's website so i can come and click on the competitor's website and i can see right away how much you're selling the product for I can also see the competitor's advertisement and go view the competitor's advertisement so I already understand if this is going to be worth it or not, all right? Now, more importantly, I can see occupations. Like, what type of occupations should I be selling towards with this heated vest? Well, you know, winter sports enthusiasts, hikers, campers, outdoor, outdoor workers, individuals in cold regions, you know, cold climates, all of these are people who you can actively be targeting, um, you know, right on here. So this is why I like the, you know, this section is because I can find winning products in only a couple clicks, like literally in only a couple clicks. How about this headrest right here? All right. Edward and wealthy guy and Tito and you guys in here. Do you believe that this would be a great problem solving product? Okay. One that keeps your, he your kids heads up whenever they're, you know, driving, not allowing them to fall over when they're sleeping. I know my son would definitely love a product like this because his neck be broke whenever he be sleeping in the car. Um, so again, another problem solving product. And again, this product right here might not be a winter pro product, but it solves a problem and it can be a giftable product for something like Christmas. Okay. It doesn't give you what you actually need. Is organic the way to start? I recommend doing paid ads first. Okay, if you don't have a lot of money, then yes, you can do uh, you can do it this way. All right. And the last section with AutoDS is going to be this TikTok spy. And TikTok spy is going to show you guys all types of different products that are working well on the TikTok side of things. So if you guys are running ads on TikTok right now, one for yes. If you're not, two for no. Or if you're doing tick or you're doing Facebook, go ahead and drop the number two. But right here on this side, again, you can notice that you can find winning products over here as well. All right. So let's go ahead and do some research with each other. And I'm going I'm to find you guys something decent. OK, I'm going to find you guys about two, three, four winning products that you guys can take advantage of today. Now, mind you, what I'm looking for is I'm looking for great engagement. 
I'm looking for a profit opportunity. I'm looking for hundreds of orders from suppliers. I'm making sure it can go with the season of trend that's currently happening today. All right, let's go ahead and look through it. All right, let's go ahead and see what I can go ahead and come up with. Let's go ahead and see what I can go ahead and come up with. I'm just going to go ahead and open up a couple, couple of these, and we're going to go through these together. All right, I'm going to open this one up. What else? Let's see. Okay, nice little cycling mask, right? Cycling mask might be really great during this time frame. We got a large capacity, you know, waterproof luggage bag for, you know, traveling with your babies. Okay, this is also really, really great. Let's go ahead and see what else we can rock with. All right, and then I'm going to go ahead and just take this one too. So let's start off with this guy. All right, this is the soft newborn baby wrap blanket. Baby sleeping bag envelope for newborn sleep stack thick in cocoon for babies between zero and nine months, okay? So with this product, all right, let's go down the line and I wanna, I wanna see if you guys are understanding what I mean by solving a problem and validating a product, okay? Does this go with a season or trend right now? Yes or no, okay? Does this go with a season or trend happening right now? One for yes or two for no, okay? Baby wrap blanket. Okay, you're noticing that this is starting to spike up every year. Okay, you see it's very consistent throughout the year, but during the winter time, you're seeing a lot more spikes up. Okay, so would it make sense to be selling this product right now? Okay, a lot of you guys are saying yes. Muhammad is saying yes. Traveler Tales is saying yes. Okay, Muhammad is saying yes. So if I know that this makes sense, let's go down to the next steps of validation. Okay. So once I understand that this is a product that A, solves a problem, has a wow factor, goes with the season of trend that's happening right now, let's validate this product together and let's find out are there other advertisers who are selling it today. So what I'm going to do again is I'm going to come over here and I'm going to type in Facebook ad library. Come over here to Facebook ad library. You can also come over here and type in TikTok ad library. Okay, These are both places that you guys can go ahead and go. I like finding literally anything on both, all right? And I'm just gonna type in the product and let's go ahead and see what we can come up with, all right? So we know that this was a baby swaddle blanket. So let's go ahead and type in baby swaddle blanket. And let's go ahead and see, are we noticing our people advertising this product today? Okay, now on Facebook ad library, there's two major things that I'm looking to do. One, I'm trying to find the main product that I'm trying to find, okay, which is this product right here. But secondly, I'm also trying to find out is there other products that are similar to this product that might make just as much sense for me to go ahead and sell. So let's go ahead and do it together. All right, baby swaddle blanket. Let's see what we're working with. Let's go ahead and see what we're working with. Here it comes right here. So let's watch this video together and let's say, let's ask ourselves a couple questions, okay? And I want you guys to go ahead and say yes or no in the chat section. Does this have good features and benefits? Can you make good different types of content with it? Does it showcase, you know, solving a problem in the ad? Does it show why you would need it and not just want it, okay? Ask yourself these questions while you're watching this because I'm telling you right now, this is a product we just found together that I guarantee once I validate it, you guys can be able to take advantage of it as well. Okay, so next thing I'm noticing is that this says six ads are being used. So let's go ahead and look at what's going on. So I have this one ad, two ads, three ads, four ads, five ads, six ads that are being ran towards this right now. So if I'm noticing that this person is running six different ads towards this product today, I know that they're spending money towards it too. Okay, so this shows me that this could be one of my main competitors, right? This could be one of my main competitors today. Let's see if we can find at least two to three competitors so we can see what's going on. This person right here, before we even continue, okay, has 107 different ads being ran towards this product today. When I say 107 ads, this is all the same ad that they are running, showcasing that they are pushing this product, okay? So look, would it make sense that this could be one of your main competitors? Would this make sense that this is probably the main competitor that you need to be basing yourself off of? Okay, you guys let me know. Okay, 
because you know when I come over here and I can look up the product itself let's type in baby okay I noticed that this product itself is being sold for $27 for the small version and $30 for the big version and we know that they are charging shipping as well so now that I know that this is my main competitor okay and I can also see that their traffic is starting to spike up last month alone then you guys know who I should be basing myself off of, okay? This is a great winning product right here. You guys could definitely take advantage of. Look, this is our other competitor that we saw earlier, okay? Look, you see this ad that was being ran? We can see that this is they have other variations of ads being ran too. So look, one thing you guys have to understand is you need to be looking for two things in these people's ad strategy, okay? One, are they running multiple variations of the same ad and two, are they, multi are they running multiple variations of the same product but with different advertisements, okay? Like I just explained to you guys, and that's the things that I am looking for. And so look, here's Baby Lovers again. Here's Baby Lovers right here. Here's Baby Lovers again. So they're running 107 of, these, of this same ad. They're running 233 of this ad, and they're running 165 of this variation of this ad as well. So if there's anybody who's going to be our main competitor, it's going to be this person right here. I'm going to go ahead and hop off this live Q&A on YouTube or on, on IG. If you guys want to go ahead and visit me on YouTube, I am live. If you guys do want to DM me, I'm giving you guys $500 off all my one-on-one -on -one mentorship packages. So make sure to take advantage of it. All right. So boom, that's one winning product we can take advantage of. But I'm not done yet. Okay, I'm not done yet. I know you guys want to get a giveaway today, right? You guys want to take advantage of a giveaway? Would it be useful if I gave you guys some Black Friday giveaways today? One for yes or two for no. All right, because I have a giveaway today that I want to give out. And I have some more product research that I want to show you guys as well. Is it cool if I give you guys this giveaway today? All right, is it cool? All right, if so, let's go ahead and get into it, all right? This giveaway today is going to give you guys a variation of a couple different things, okay? First thing is it's going to give you the opportunity of winning a free one-on-one -on -one consulting call and getting an inside look of my one-on-one -on -one mentorship. We're going to be able to get all of your questions answered, streamline your success, and be able to feel confident after this call because you'll also be getting a 2024 success plan tailored around you. So when you get off this call, you know exactly what to go ahead and do. And, you know, this is how you go ahead and win. So if you guys want to win this, I'm going to go ahead and give this giveaway winner out in 15 minutes. In 15 minutes. What you have to do is go to my Instagram at AC underscore Hampton. You have to follow me. You have to scroll down to this video right here. You have to like it. You have to repost it on your story. Okay? And then comment the word Wi-Fi bread and come back in here and say the word done. Okay, so again, you need to like this video. You need to repost it to your story. You need to comment the word Wi-Fi bread and come back in here and say the word done. And I'll be choosing the winner in about 15 minutes. Okay, in about 15 minutes. Okay, to give you guys an inside look of like what, like I told you guys, what my one-on-one -on -one mentorships are 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 doing for you know my students every single day, like. You know, would it be useful if you could take a product from zero and generate over $97,000 in 16 days? Would this be useful for you? Okay, if you guys could replicate the same success, okay, or if you guys could come in and make your first $300 in sales your first week, or, you know, come over here and do close to $2,000 a day, okay, this is what we do here at Supreme Econ. And I always showcase you guys the students of the week, so I want to go ahead and highlight the student of the week this week. Okay, and a student, look, this one just came in while we're live, okay? First order, y'all. First campaign ever ran, $33, man. Just got that today. Congrats, Lance, okay? But the student of the week is actually Miss Pauline, okay? Miss Pauline, who came to me, okay, with a completely disabled ads manager, okay? With nothing working for her. We got the ad account back. We got the business manager back. And then within the first day advertising, not even on a cold interest testing campaign, literally just testing creatives, she was able to bounce back and not give up on herself with over $205 in sales with a 5% conversion rate. Congrats, Miss Pauline. Okay, congrats, Miss Pauline. She is a 50-year-old woman. 
50 year old woman so if she could do it you guys can do it as well okay ended up getting all of this back in first day advertising right over 200 dollars in sales we celebrate the big wins the small wins and everything in between and by the way if you guys do want to join my free discord channel i'm gonna have my team posted down below okay where you guys can go ahead and be around myself other like-minded individuals be around my team and see the successes of my students daily so that you guys can be able to continue to stay motivated all right i mean would it be useful if you guys could do forty-seven thousand dollars, you know in nine days like we don't try to do this we actually do this from getting your first sale to scaling up to over a hundred thousand dollars or even seventeen thousand in seven days again miss pauline you are the student of the week congratulations everybody say congratulations pauline and i'm gonna have my team post a discord link down below if you guys do want to go ahead and join the discord okay here you guys go all righty let's go ahead and get into some more product research methods that i love to go ahead and use we're not done yet okay we are not done yet all right another free product research tool that i love taking advantage of okay is actually one of my favorites so i'm gonna come over here and it's called are you guys ready i, I want to hear if you guys have heard of this before as well okay and honestly this is like my laziest way to do it okay but the easiest way that you guys can go ahead and do free product research tool and this is, is again this is free okay is with this right here called where is it at ad finder okay when you have Ad Finder on, what you guys are going to notice it's going to do is it's going to turn my entire news feed into just advertisements. Okay, if you guys have heard of my Ad Finder before, let me know. Okay, if you guys have heard of my Ad Finder before, let me know. Basically, once it lo logs all, once it loads everything up, okay, and actually I can turn on auto scroll, it will literally just scroll down and show me all of the ads that are being ran today, okay? So I'm telling you guys right now, if you guys are wanting a free product research tool, this is the one for you guys, okay? My ad finder, all right? That's another big thing I like doing, okay? Let's get into another product research tool, which is gonna be called TikTok Creative Center. If you guys have used this, one for yes or two for no. You guys can type in certain keywords like winter, and see what type of things are working the best. All right, let's go ahead and do this real quick. Let's go ahead and do this product right here. These men's winter, gloves have winter gloves, again, you guys are seeing are showing up. These men's winter gloves have These men's winter gloves have so would it make sense to be so selling these type of products right now? And this is on TikTok. I'm showing you guys TikTok winning products that you guys can do for free. Or what about this big you know, winter hoodie. I know you guys have seen this on, if you guys have ever seen this on TikTok, say yes or say no, but this is a major product. I actually have a student scaling right now. Um, did right around $70,000 in sales in the last month right off of this, okay? So TikTok Creative Center is a great way to get inspiration. And by the way, you guys can take these products and look, write them up on Facebook Ad Library and you guys can find them there as well, okay? If you wanna find Facebook winning products. Now, another thing, let's go ahead and find some more products. Okay, I'm not done with you guys. If you guys want me to keep going crazy, let me know, okay? And by the way, I have $500 off, okay? My one-on-one -on -one mentorship ending today, okay? If you guys wanna take advantage of it, you guys can go there or you can message me right here on my Instagram at AC underscore Hampton, all right? Let's find some other winning products for you guys today, okay? We got this nice little ski mask. This is really breathable, great for bicycling, cycling. You know people will still stay active in the winter time, all right? Let's go ahead and see what they're selling this product for. So this product is $25.99, okay? They have multiple different variations available. Again, another great winning product, all right? I'm gonna try to get you guys as many winning products that I know are working right now so you guys can go ahead and do something with it after this, all right? If you guys have ever heard about the thermal leggings, let me know. Ooh, this is fire right here. Super thick woman winter plush thick warm pants, okay? So these are sweatpants that have uh, that have thermals inside of it, okay? Now you guys tell me, would it not be useful to go ahead and take advantage of something like this, okay? 
I actually really, I've never seen this product before. <laughs> I might have to get it for myself. All right. But winter women fleece lined pants. These are not the leggings. These are the pants. Now for the women in here, I'm going to ask you guys a question. Would you be happy if your man got you something like this? One for yes or two for no. Okay. Would you be happy if your man got you something like this? Got it for Christmas or, you know, just got it for you for the hell of it. Okay. If you knew, okay, that you wanted this. Okay. Think of if you guys are saying yes, then I'm going to let you know that other people are saying it as well. This right here is a great, great problem solving winning product. Okay. If you guys have not taken advantage of something like this, okay, you guys let me know. All right. And for the people who are asking about my Discord, I'll go ahead and post it down below for you guys. All right. I actually really like this product. I'm not going to lie. All right. But this is how fast I'm finding winning products on this platform. And you guys just got to go ahead and look and validate that other people are selling it today. Okay. What other winning products do you guys want to go ahead and do? I'll show you guys some more. Have you guys ever heard of Tamu? Have you guys ever heard of this one for yes or two for no? Okay, like I said, smash that like button down below because I have a full document for you guys. Okay, showcasing exactly everything that I'm telling you guys. All right, again, when I'm looking for Facebook products, okay, I'm utilizing the trend and the season. When I'm on Facebook ad library, these are the things that I'm looking for. All right, when I'm looking for a type of winning products, these are the price ranges I'm looking for. Again, take advantage of this. Once I validate a winning product, I come over here to similar web and I try to figure out are they getting traffic today i bought i bought there already privately very cool hey i'm trying to tell you guys okay next thing is we have to move have you guys ever heard of to move this is a platform that not drop shippers buy from but real people and if real people are buying from this what makes you guys think that drop shippers are not selling this as well let me give you guys like couple winning products right now let's go ahead and look for it again i'm looking for anything that might be problem solving okay anything that might be problem solving let's go ahead and get into it let's go ahead and get into it we have i'm gonna go ahead and find three or four and by the way i'm giving out this giveaway winner in the next five minutes okay in the next five minutes here is the giveaway instructions here, are, here is the giveaway instructions for all the people in here and what you will be winning, okay? What you will be winning. All right, let's go ahead and start off with this real quick. A vacuum sealer machine for food preserves, okay? We all know that people are cooking a lot during this time frame, you know, with Christmas and the holidays still being here. Don't you think that, you know, kitchen gadgets might be really, really useful right now, okay? But don't you think it might be even more useful if you don't listen to me at all, but you come over here and type in something like kitchen gadgets and see when they are working the best, where again, what time are you guys seeing this doing the best? All throughout November and December, you're seeing kitchen gadgets work the best. Why are kitchen gadgets doing the best right now? You guys tell me, okay? And by the way, my team at Supreme Ecom is in here. So if you guys have questions, Okay, my team is also in here to answer it. They are posting links for you guys as well. So if you guys have any questions, make sure to reach out to them. But if I know that with consumer demand that, you know, kitchen gadgets like this might be working really well, then all I have to do is just find other people who are selling it on Facebook or TikTok and just take over the market. Okay, I'll do the example right here, right? If you know a portable washing machine, Okay, would this be a giftable item that might be really great to give during Christmas? Yes or no? Would this be an item that you guys can be selling all year around? Let's go ahead and see. Portable washing machine, right? Washing machine. Let's go ahead and type it into Facebook ad library and see if we can find anybody who's advertising it today. And by the way, I can show you guys one of my ads for this product that I've scaled to over $500,000 in two months. But let's go ahead and see it for other people. Okay. Portable washing machine. Okay. We see active ads being ran today. But again, look at what I'm telling you I'm looking for on Facebook. Okay. 
when I'm on Facebook ad library, okay? I'm looking, are there multiple ads running for the same ad from the competitor? Are there multiple different variations of ads that are working? And are there other products similar to the main feature product? And by the way, if you guys want this full list right here, smash the like button down below and get this video to 250 likes. Now, by the way, if you do not win the giveaway today, I'm giving out two giveaways. Okay, I'm giving out another giveaway winner um, on Monday. Okay, so if you guys do not win today, okay, all you have to do is still follow the instructions that I told you guys to do before. And then the last thing you need to do is comment your biggest takeaway of this video afterwards in the chat section. All right, so I'm gonna ask you guys a question while we watch this together. Does this solve a problem? Yes or no? Does this have a wow factor? Yes or no? Can this be sold or gifted during the season and trend that's happening right now? Yes or no? Does this have good features and benefits? Can this appeal to a mass audience of people? Okay, you guys let me know, okay? Because that's all I'm doing all day. And I'll come over here, portable washing machine. Again, you guys saw I went from here. I found a product that I liked. I came to Facebook ad library. I'm seeing, are there people running the ad today? Okay, by the way, there's like a whole Stop nother one right here. So maybe even if I don't sell the main one I just showed you guys, here's another variation right here. Multiple colors, multiple different ways that you guys can use it. It's honestly a little bit bigger. It gives you the portable washing machine and the washer all in one, so it kind of solves the problem. So you don't even have to have a dishwasher, okay? Look, this is what you guys are seeing people are taking advantage of. And I found it in only a couple seconds on Tamu, okay? And when I come over here and type in portable washing machine, okay, you guys are gonna notice that people are running ads towards it today. Let me do plus myshopify.com. Okay, here's a person selling it right here. Here's another person selling it right here. Again, I don't care if you have reviews. I don't care about none of that. I'm just over here looking to see who do I wanna base myself off of, okay? We'll start off with these three people right here. Okay, let's start off with these three. Let's see who's getting the most traffic, okay? Are you getting traffic? You are, okay? Are you getting traffic? 195,000 visitors last month alone. And this is Walmart, so I'm not gonna base myself off of that. But Tamu is not dangerous for dropshipping because it's just showcasing consumer demand. Who is buying from Tamu? Consumers. Who's buying from dropshippers? Consumers. You wanna be where consumers are, okay? These are some of my favorite ways that I do product research and validation. And now I'm gonna go ahead and get into the giveaway winner. Like I told you guys, you had to go down to the video, you had to like it, you had to repost it, okay? This video right here. So let's go ahead and see what's going on. Let's go ahead and see who's really taking advantage of it, who's reposted it to their story, okay? And I'm gonna choose the winner as simple as this, all right? Now, by the way, like I told you guys, I have a great deal going on right now, okay? Right now, where you guys are seeing $500 off any of my one-on-one -on -one mentorship packages. This is the, currently the deal that I have going on. If you guys wanna take advantage of this, reach out to me on my Instagram at AC underscore Hampton, or you guys can apply at supremeecom.com, all right? Now, I'm gonna go ahead and get into the giveaway winner. Let's go ahead and get into it. Let me go ahead and clear all this out and show you guys who the winner is going to be, all right? And like I said, once this video reaches 250 likes, it will be posted after this. And if you do not win today, you will have another chance of winning this Monday. If on this live, you comment your biggest takeaway in the comment section right afterwards, okay? Are you guys ready? We're gonna go ahead and open all these up real quick, okay? Let's go ahead and open all these up, and then I'm gonna go ahead and choose the winner. Okay, you guys ready? Let's go ahead and do it. Oops. View story on highlights. All right. Are you guys ready? We're just gonna choose one at random. 10, oops. 
I'm going to go ahead and get back to it real quick. Okay. Are you guys ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. I'm going to close my eyes. Let's do, let's do, let's do this person right here. The wealthy guy. Let's see if he follows me. Let's see if he follows me. He does follow me. So congratulations, my boy. Congratulations, everybody in here. I appreciate you guys being in here. If you did not win, you still get another opportunity of winning this Monday. Okay, so make sure to go ahead and show up when that video is dropped. It will be on my YouTube channel with the video I dropped this Monday. And for everybody in here, if you need to reach out to me, here is my Instagram. If you want to go ahead and apply for the 10 spots that we have left for the month and get $500 off of my Black Friday special, here you guys can go ahead and take advantage of it. You guys can see all the things you'll be able to win as well. I appreciate you guys being in here.